sing like a lark. Mm. And uh, then after that, she did come on to the opera, and I don't know more about that than I do, I guess. Well, she visited quite a bit backstage yeah. before she got up enough nerve to ask me one one night down there. Yeah. Hey, um, do you think I could ever become a member of the opera? Yeah. Of course, I'd heard her sing before, and I knew her talent. And it says, if you want to be on the Opry, you're on right now. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And you had the uh, honor of putting her on. Mm -hmm. I didn't know that. Well, one of the most tragic events in the history of the Opry took place in the early 1960s, I believe it was in March of 62 or 63, when, when the plane crash occurred over in... Uh, West Camden, Tennessee. Camden, right? Yeah, we're around Camden, though. Mm -hmm. Odd, what yeah. do you remember about that? Oh, I was, I was in bed one night with the radio on, as I usually do still. <laughs> <laughs> and we got this tragic news about the plane crash. Nobody had any great detail about it. But, uh, I don't guess you knew about it, Odd, but uh, they, they wanted me to go on that trip. No, I wasn't aware of that. Well, uh, they did. And uh, Mildred, my wife, found out that who was going to be the pilot. And we were aware of the fact of his uh, yeah. experience. He had no, no, not much experience. Mm -hmm. uh, he was uh, uh, Cowboy, Cowboy Copes' uh, son-in-law. Yeah. Randy. Andy, Randy Hughes. Randy Hughes. Mm -hmm. And, uh, Cowboy Copus. And, yeah. And, uh, uh, Randy Hughes was, was the pilot. Patsy was, um, and who was the other one? Uh, uh, uh Hawkshaw. Hawkshaw, a big Hawkshaw. tall boy. I was yeah. <laughs> trying to... And they went, yeah. they, I was supposed to know, see, yeah, that was, they went down there to play a, a charity thing for mm -hmm. some person, I've forgotten who it was, and they wanted me on it. And I, uh, I, I refused to ride. Them. And then they offered to ride me on, on the, uh, on, on a special flight out of here for that. And I refused that. I said, just go on the stage, and tell, they, they'd already advertised me anyway. I said, you just apologize to people and tell them I'm just not able to make the trip. And, I wasn't feeling too good, and Mildred didn't want me to go, and and I refused it, that trip. 